So hello guys, today we are going to install the NV graphic mod along with the ENV mod and also the DLSS 3 mod where all the mods are the latest version. So make sure you get the latest one, download this and you to also download the basic ENV file with the version of 0492. Make sure you download this too. First we are going to install the NV graphic mod and this is the graphic mod over here. So now start your open IV and click over here and make sure you select the path where you unzip this mod and from here select the path 1. Now click on open install. So we have successfully ensured the part 1, the same goes for the part 2 ok. Now select the part 2, open mods folder, install. So now we have ensured the main packages, let's go for the add-ons, now go into optional add-ons, from here, bright MNC lights, select the OIV, click on install mods folder and then install. Now we are going for the parallax sword, now select the file over here, click on open, install, mods folder, install. Now we are going for the volumetric cloud, ok, same procedure, select the OIV file, click on install, mods folder and then install. Over here high quality reflection, make sure you install this mod too, this is a good one over here and this go into your games folder. Here extra vegetation, install this mod too. Volumetric headlight, select this file too and click on install, games folder, install. White sheet lights, select this file and make sure you install this too. It's up to you, okay, if you want to install this or not. The Norton lights, make sure to install this. This is a good one. The game config, which is the important file over here. If you don't install this, there might be a possibility that your game might crash, okay. Make sure you install the game config. So that's all we have installed the add-on file. Now we are going for the reshade of the NVE. From here, select all the files and drag and drop this into your GTA file directory. Now we are going to install the basic ENV files. This is the basic file from the latest version. You need to go inside this folder and from here, except last two files, select all the files, okay? And drag and drop this into your GTA file directory. So this is the ENV from the GTA 5 mods. So from here, select both the INA file and drag and drop this into GTA 5 directory and make sure you replace it. So we have successfully installed the ENV mods too. So before we install the DLSS mod, make sure you open your GTA 5 game. Now go on to the settings over here graphics then we have to disable these two options okay one is FXAA and the MSAA make sure you disable it then click on apply and then exit the game now we are going to ensure the DLSS mod and from here select both the ASR file and drag and drop this into GTA 5 directory and make sure you replace it now now go into a mods folder and from here too and select all the file and drag and drop this over here after that, open NVIDIA console panel, over there, manage 3D settings and go on to the program settings. Over here, you have to select the gta5.exe file, okay? Make sure you select the file and then go on the below, over here, vertical sync, make sure you enable it. This is one of the important steps too, we have to enable it, okay? And then apply and then quit, okay? So that's all folks, we have successfully installed all the mods. Now open your gta5 game. So we are back here guys and here is the volumetric clouds and also the NV graphic mod. So all are working good. Now press shift plus enter so we can enable the ENV. See, this is also working and now enable it. It's working guys. This ENV is working with the latest NV version and also you can check the FPS. It's around 50 to 55. Now press insert a home button. So this is the NV reshade which is also working with our ENV. And let's check the weather. See, all weathers are working right now. NB reshade is working with ENB. And here is the DLSS menu. So this is one. Now click on enable over here. And from here, DLSS frame generation. Make sure you enable this too. Now see the FPS guys. From 50 to 55, it jumped to 100, 105, 110. So it's working. And now let's disable the ENB and check the FPS. See, from 110, it jumped to 115, 120. It increases, okay. NV reshade, ENB and DLSS mod all are working. Now let's enable the ENB again. It decreased from 120 to 110, 105. So all mods are working fine guys. So make sure you follow my step and you will get everything work okay. And soon I will also drop my custom ENB. For that make sure you subscribe to my channel. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Till then, peace out.